YouTube, 10D lights, all of them. Everything got smoked out. I had to repair them too. Catch the scooter. I had to repair them too. I had to repair one of them. I cracked it when I was tinting it. I had to repair them too. They all look pretty decent. Hey, come here, Zari. Boy, been getting dizzy, man. Trying to get these little parts handled. I'm ready to spray this thing. But yeah, I've been over here. I don't got the trunk smooth. Right here where the emblem used to be at, it was rust holes right there. And there's a couple of rust holes around. Got all that's nice and smooth, so. She's smooth. I can scuff her up and go ahead and spray her with some, um, with some primer to get this emblem off. But yeah, she ready for prime. You too, your boy been getting busy. I'm out here sanding his um, bumpers down. Y'all can see, this is what I sent it. This is what I haven't sent You see the camera? Can't see the camera. But yeah, man, I'm prepping these things, getting them ready to paint. Sand them all the way down. Hit them with some epoxy primer. I already got this one sanding all the way down. And what I did earlier, clean the inside of it out, painted it. Did yeah, both on like that. Painted the pieces that go inside of. Just so everything will be uniform and ain't got that rusty look. But yeah. Can't see the camera, man. Cannot see the camera. All right, now I don't start the sanding the side trim. The panels. Already on did these two. I'm sanding down real good. This is what they looked like before. I'm about to hit these four. And I got to sand all this stuff. All the plastic pieces. Well, everything over here going to have to get done by hand mostly. Especially the plastic pieces. And I'm going to get some um, adhesion promoter. Spray on all the plastic pieces before I even paint them. Well, let me get back to it. And these fold down real quick.
Cause y'all getting, getting dim out here. It ain't all the way dark. Well, look at that there. Let's wait till it get dark. This bitch gonna be beaming. But this all I needed. Shit. That way, that way when it do get dark, I ain't gotta take off. I can finish up, but I'm about to take off now, goddamn. I gotta go home and sand all this. I'm gonna be sanding all night. Mm. I'm gonna be sanding all night. Over the plastic ones probably go smooth. I probably it probably won't take too long. Just cause they all small pieces. Yeah, look at them bumpers. Them bumpers done. Well, look at that light under here. This is nice. It ain't seen shiny no more. You can't see no more reflections in it. That's the far as I got it. No reflections. I should be able to get some paint and stick to this. I need to hit up enough. Should look smooth enough. And right there. Get up in them crevices. Hit that with the hand. But yeah. Oh yeah, I seen it. I hit all them too. All them ready for paint. Yes sir. I'm spraying them all. It's gonna be nice and cloudy out here. It's gonna put out way more than them cans. Yes, sir. Let me show y'all my little light set up, YouTube. Y'all know these GoPros is trash at, at night time. I'm all the way over here. So y'all can see what is about dark out here. Let me let y'all see my little light set up. Oh, oh, she lit. Oh, she lit. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Boy, it's like it's daytime under here again. She lit. I had to stay until it was dark so I could show y'all my little light set up. Well, yeah, that's six lights. They going, they going crazy. Two at the top, two on that side, two on that side. This is what it looked like with the lights off. Exact same area. This is exactly what it looked like with the lights off. All right, YouTube. Today is the day that I turned that carport to a paint booth. So this is what I got. This is six mil greenhouse plastic. It's 45. No, it's 40 by 25, 40 feet by 25 feet. And I'm hoping that it'll fit over that carport. The carport really ain't that tall, so well, I can, I could touch the shit without even standing on my tippy toes or whatnot. I got two fans. I got the plastic. I got two fans. I got some filters. Now I'm about to get up there there's some tree limbs and stuff up there. I'm about to get up there, throw all the tree limbs off, and then I'm gonna see if I can get the plastic reach all the way across it.
All right, you two, so far, that's what we got. Yeah, it's 40 feet by 25 feet, so it's a lot of extra on that side. So what I'll probably do. Yup. Yup. And then I figure I got some um, painter's plastic. I figure something out for the back right here. And this might be where I put the fans at, right here in the back. One on this side, one on that side. Yes, sir. But other than that, she's covered. That shit worked out pretty smooth. Now I'm gonna um. Alright, so far this is where I'm at. I went and grabbed some two by fours. The wind blowing this thing. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take the plastic to the two by fours at the bottom. I'm gonna get up there and put some tape along that in the inside. Keep that wind from blowing it on the front. And then I'm gonna figure out how I'm gonna get my corners, little pieces over here, and start taping all of it tight. So the wind won't be able to grab it and take it nowhere. And get this thing secured, put a little time lapse on. Yeah, and that's where we at, baby. YouTube, I got the booth about 90% done. Yeah. Look, something slight, something slight. I gotta um cover up this front piece. And then at the back, I'm gonna put the fans back there. I'm gonna put one fan on this side, one fan on the other side. I'm gonna have one on this side blowing out. On the other side, I'm gonna have it blowing clean air in. So, but yeah, that's the booth, man. That's the paint booth. The paint for the Chevy will be here tomorrow. So, tomorrow, I'm gonna get over here. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna paint all the chrome first. Got all the chrome sanded down. Got all that ready. I'm gonna paint the chrome first. Then, kind of cool, really. I think I'm gonna um, finish prepping the Chevy. And get her painted sometime this weekend. But I'm gonna start with the chrome. Then I think I'm gonna paint the arm, um, the wheel wells, and everything I'm gonna do up under the hood, paint all that. And then I paint the car. So y'all stay tuned, man. I'm about to watch the OBS. This thing is filthy, dog. Like she is nasty. I gotta get them decals off. Cause she will be getting painted next. I got the sunroof already that I'm gonna put in her. Yeah, so I'm gonna clean it up. First thing I'm gonna do, the AC ain't working. So I'm gonna um, clean it up, take it to the shop, see about getting that AC working. And then when I get done painting the Chevy, she next.
tool, so the booth is about 90% done. She about 90% done. Yeah. So she look on the inside. Put on the little lights on. Yeah. On that side over there, I'm gonna put a fan with a filter blowing air out. On this side right here, I'm gonna put a fan with a filter blowing air in. Cover this front part up. But yeah, other than that, man, she about she about ready. The dogs wanna start barking when I wanna record my video. But yeah, man. See, I'm about 90% done. This is all I gotta cover up right here. It. So when I come back tomorrow, I'm gonna finish covering that up, put my fans up, and I'm gonna go ahead and spray all the chrome. <clears throat> Look at that OBS though. Look at that OBS. It should look a million times better with the rims clean. The whole truck clean, but sheesh. Yes, sir. Yeah. Dude, 90% done, dog. The paint for her, I'll be here tomorrow. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Y'all check out my little homemade paint booth. Aunt just be letting me come over here and do whatever to the house. You know, I ain't gonna tear nothing up though. And if I do, I'm gonna fix it. But yeah, booth 90% done, baby. It's six mil plastic, kind of, it's holding up too. But yeah, there she go, man. Paint booth, baby. All right, YouTube, I'm back. It's the next day. For the most part, I got the booth sealed up. Got one fan over here blowing air in. Got one over there that's gonna blow air out. I got some plastic that I put at the front. Whenever it's time to close up the front. But right now, I'm about to unbox this paint gun. I already got the um the air filter put on the compressor. And I got the paint gun. I'm about to go ahead and put the paint gun together, get it set up, do a little unboxing. And then it's go time. So yeah, I got that 3M gun. I got some extra nozzles. I got these um, filters that go on the gun. Some of these. I think it come with a um, regulator. I even just got a digital one, but I think it come with one. But yeah. Open this thing up, man. I don't have this for a while now. Yeah, that's what she come with. She come with the gun, the um, the regulator. Come with a cup, liners, and different um spray tips. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. If I can get in this thing. They box this. They box the hell out of this. Mm. There she go. There she go. Okay. First thing first on top is the gun. Oh, we got decent enough light in here. I got that thing over the needle. Got some scrunches. Some scrunches came with that thing. Coming in, I just ordered this extra. We got one um, big ones in it. 
1.4. I ordered this because it got um 1.6, 1.8, and a 2.0. So just ordered it to have it. For the cups, cups, the tops. One cup, got the liners with it, five liners. That's the instruction manual. Yep. Pressure is a little. I grabbed this digital one from um, Harbor Freight. Digital. So yeah. I guess I put this on first, then slap one of the air filters on it. To the side, to the side. But yeah, this will come with the 3M on um, paint gun, man. Huh? This stuff ain't come with it. I just got this X, so I'm about to put it together. But yeah, that's how she go. Little quick unboxing. Little quick unboxing. First time for everything, so. Yes, sir. Go time. I'm about to set this gun up. Clean this, clean everything out of here, sweep it up real good. And um get all the chrome laid out. And I'll cut y'all back on. Check that thing there out. Yes, sir. It is go time. Mm. We're trying to get busy, man. Huh? It's time to get busy. I just want to show y'all the gun right quick. All right, YouTube, quick update. This box right here is full of all the chrome trim that I'm gonna be painting black. I already don't sand it all of it down. Everything took forever. Literally like 15 hours. But got all that sanded. All this center, all this is being clean. I'm gonna wipe this down with soapy water, dry it off. All this has been clean. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna go ahead and um, wet this floor, close that part up. I got some plastic I'm gonna put at the front, close that part up, and I got another two by four that I'm gonna use to anchor the plastic down. I'm gonna tape it on. Use it on uh, two by four to anchor it down up there. Wet this floor, mix up some um, epoxy primer, and I'm gonna go ahead and spray these with some epoxy primer. All these pieces, this is basically the front and back bumper and all the trim that go around the bottom of the car, so the rocker panels, I guess that's what they call them. All right, you two. I don't hit it with three coats of epoxy primer. I hit it with three coats of the 2K problem. I'm gonna come over here, I'm gonna let it dry all night. I'm gonna come back tomorrow. And I'm gonna hit it with a guide coat. Probably wet sand all the. All right, YouTube, quick update. Just got finished wet sanding everything. Everything nice and smooth. Nice and smooth. The 
you probably gonna hit him with one more. Hit him with one more coat. Or that primer. Maybe two. Or that primer. That 2K primer. And then I go behind it with the arm. Um, with the base coat, baby. All right, you two. I'm about to close it out right here. All right, you two. I hit it with two coats of the 2K primer. I'm gonna let it dry all night. Now I come back tomorrow, tack it, and hit it with the um. Start on the base coat. But yeah. Yes, sir. I got all my lights on except one. Except one. All my lights going except one. There she go. But yeah, I'm gonna come tomorrow, tack it. And now I start with the base coat. But yeah, she's smooth. Mm. Chrome delete, baby. But yeah, I'm gonna close this video out right here. Like, share, comment, subscribe, tell me what y'all think about this chrome delete can't wait to put the color on it it's gonna be black blacking it out damn everything look good boy trying not to block the light yes sir Everything is looking awesome. So yeah, like, share, comment, subscribe, man. I'm gonna holler at y'all on the next one. Next video, I'm gonna start off with me painting these and then painting everything else. I got a whole bunch of more stuff that I got to paint black. Probably won't record that. But yeah. Like, share, comment, subscribe, man. Today the second. I'm going to have this box sprayed. I'm going to have this box sprayed by the 10. So I'm going to give myself, I got eight days. They had his car done. Had a paint done anyway. Once I get the paint and stuff done, then it's straight to engine work. But yeah, like, share, comment, subscribe. Tell me what y'all think about my first paint job, man. Tell me what y'all think. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all on the next one. I'm out.